Hello, I'm Jerry Rigged, and this is the Duskers Daily Challenge for September 25th, 2018. Looking at yesterday's leaderboard, 17 players with Pyrax taking the top score with an 885, which would be because... Ship scan. Ship scan. Ship scan would give them an extra three. And... <clears throat> yeah, okay. Uh, assuming the same health and everything else, ship scan would do it. The integrator scored an 851, and Mustika 21 and 845, getting one extra scrap. And if I'd played smart, I could have probably gotten there too. Longfellow player, 821, Deno 416, 813, Decavoid, 795, Kobo Commando, also 795, Peak, 785, and GRZ, 758, with LB taking 11th with a 715 due to, well, some bad luck, and uh, I think he said a little bit of bad planning, which, you know, I had too, so. Today we have Stealth again, fantastic, but pretty average drone health. I'll told I'll take stealth and average drone health over just about anything else. I take stealth and bad drone health over just I, I just I want stealth. I want stealth. Military B, two infestations, medium hull integrity. Not anything else to really do here. So let's go ahead and get right in. We do have an open door. And a busted terminal. Well, that is unfortunate. I do hear a swarm somewhere. Oh, that's... <sighs> that's a problem. I don't have to worry about swarm today. Or slime. Alright. Alright, I have a plan. You've got to be shitting me. Alright, that'll do. No active terminals today. I'd say that was a little bit of a challenge. I like that though. 
Um, just in case it blows up in D4, then I won't need anything else. Nope, it blew up in D9. Uh, I'll let the Leaper live. And that swarm goes off into space. Terrible, terrible day. Total of 10 scrap, 1 propulsion fuel. Starting score of 530 and nothing else. 735. And LB got extra drone health. Overall, I mean, it wasn't a terrible ship. I can see Longfellow player, who was a newer player, I believe, but I think has been watching LB for a while, uh, didn't take the risk that they could have with the swarm. Uh, there were a couple other ways to do it as well. If you had the boarding ship docked, you could have used that as an escape route instead of the uh, leaving the door open for the other room, which was a risk. It wasn't much of a risk, but it was a risk. So, if you haven't done your run yet, good luck. If you have, leave a comment with your experiences and strategies for a ship like this. Overall, as always, I think Stealth is king and served well for this ship. Uh, Lure would have also been relatively good. Um, with that open door, things would have been a little bit riskier, but not too bad. And uh, two busted terminals. And I said the other day that I don't remember ever seeing two busted terminals in a ship. Well, clearly, it's a thing. If you'd like to check out other videos, you can see Marvin, Copper, Dino 416, LB, Mustika 21, Dargard, Decavoid, Murkowler, Quarantoth, and Agenda 1999, all listed in the video description. If you enjoyed, do please like, and have a good day.